Hello everybody, body. My name is Mr. Beef. I'm back again doing a Splatoon 3 D single player campaign. Um, I decided that going forward, um, well, first of all, it's been a while, so sorry for being gone for so long. But I've also decided that um, going forward, I'm just gonna complete just gonna go ahead do whatever I can to complete the game I'm not gonna go I'm not gonna wait around I'm just gonna go ahead and complete all the objectives I can I'm not gonna try to 100% it if I if I want to 100% something I'll 100% it during a live stream or something because it's taking this is taking way too long and I'm not gonna wait and I'm not waiting that long it's already been a month it's been over a month since a month, I think, since the last episode came out. So I'm just gonna go ahead, finish this up, and to five. Yeah, I'm just gonna jump. So yeah, I'm gonna go to site four and not go immediately to site five because. Site 4, yeah, I'm pretty sure Site 4 is going to be the, um, hold on, parts of interest, it doesn't matter. Site 4, pretty sure, is going to be the faster way. Yeah, it's faster, it's faster. It's going to, well, not stop, no, not faster, it's going to be more detailed. I want to experience more, I want to experience more of the story before, sorry, I don't want to just instantaneously win. So we're going to go ahead, do Site 4, then 5, and then finally Site 6. Landfill Dreamland. Yeah, it's a landfill. That's why it's dirty. Nope, that's Boss Kettle. Um, It's been a while since I played Splatoon. I've really been just... I've really been playing a lot of Xenoverse. I've been playing a lot of Xenoverse for a while. And so with all the Xenoverse I've been playing because I'm going to say this, first of all, I didn't know there was I didn't know no Super Saiyan God. I didn't know Super Saiyan God came out and I also didn't know there was a bunch of DLCs, so I've just been playing a lot of Xenoverse and hold on. Yeah, hold on. Sorry if I'm getting a little distracted. I was is this is this a is this a nuclear submarine? Because I don't know if this is a nuclear submarine or not because it reminds me of that big ass Russian submarine they had. Ah yes, right over here. Decoration. Yeah, this reminds me of that nuclear submarine Russian made during the Cold War. Alright. I forgot the name, but yeah. Yeah, that begin and by the way, one of the things I want to I want to go ahead and say the beginning section of the story mode I hope we get to go back to that because because that those first levels and that be first beginning section was pretty was pretty cool. Ooh, first this is the um okay, that's the first um I think core level you have to play, but I am trying to do. Um, I'm not. I'm, I want to play all the levels in the area. Right. Where are you at? All right, great. Oh. Uh. 
Yeah, anyways, I was talking about me playing Xenoverse 2. I did, had no idea that you could ha that Super Saiyan God was a thing. Had no idea that one play that Super Saiyan God was a thing. They didn't know you can get Super Saiyan Blue. So I really was just playing Xenoverse 2 for a while. And I really just got addicted to playing Xenoverse 2. Also, another game I was addicted to, um, I really played Hush Hush. If you guys don't know, a game by Sad Panda Studios, you know. Not the best game to be mentioning while playing Splatoon, you know, a child-friendly game, but I personally enjoy it. I like the story. I love the... I really enjoyed it. It was one of the more... It was one of the things I was actually excited to play because it was just me listening to the story. I didn't have to focus... I didn't have to focus on gameplay. I was just listening to the story, making my decisions, and I got the good ending of that game. Was really ha was really happy. Really made me happy playing that game. And was um I don't want to go ahead and say that it lacked content. I'm not gonna say that. But I want more. It's a game that leaves me wanting more from it. I I hope if they continued if Sad Panda Studios does continue to make those kind of games I would enjoy it a lot because I want more of that kind of content I enjoy it so yeah that's all I have to that's all I have to say in regards to that I it's just leaving me wanting more hashtag pawn sound like a boss okay so it's a bunch of hashtags I Uh, if you do want to check it out, I really highly suggest playing that game because it was one of the few games where, you know, after playing a lot of, I've played a couple, I've played a couple visual novels. It was one of the few visual novels that actually, you know, pulled at me for a while. It actually pulled that, it, it actually takes something out of you, it actually pulls out your heartstrings a little bit. That was the only time I ever experienced that with a visual novel, and I really just think that they made a good game. So yeah, all right. Um, I don't know the order of Soaker Blocks. I'm gonna go ahead, yeah, I'm gonna do this one. This is. I think this is, this is story one. Nope, I'm gonna do it anyways, all right. All right, let's, um, let's finish this. Damn, I've been talking for eight minutes. Eight minutes. Wow, that's that's a new record. That's a new record for how long? Okay, yeah, that's a new record for how long I've been talking. I've never talked that much before. All right, the soaker blocks. Oh no, they're gonna have they're gonna have me fight somebody with a high ass fire rate. I know that. Okay. 
Oh, all right. There, there's the issue we're gonna have. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and say this. Sorry, I haven't been making as many videos as I like to. Because usually when I make videos, usually if I make videos, I... Let's try this again. All right, there we go. Wow. All right, I thought that was gonna be a lot worse. I was told, all right, cause, oh shit, no, don't wanna do that again. I was told a lot more that this would be like the Octo expansion, but it really isn't. Because normally, when I heard Octo Expansion, I was here, I was assuming you're actually going to struggle a lot during these levels, but it's not that bad. It's not that bad, and I know during editing, I'm going to fucking regret that. This is, I'm going to regret those choice of words. I know for a fact that this game is going to say, oh, it's been easy so far. Now you're going to get your ass beat. That's because that's usually how the shit goes. They throw a couple easy levels at you for fun and the shit of it. And then they sit, then, you know, near the, then, you know, once you're almost done with the midpoint, they say, fuck you. And then you're just done. I know I know how I know how they play the game. I know how the game is played. I'm just hoping at least uh nope, not yet. Aha. Alright. So we're gonna go ahead and complete this. Cause I cause once after a certain point in the game, like that's what kinda of what happened in the Acto Expansion Acto Expansion, they made you learn how to play the game. I mean, it doesn't matter which one I use. I'm gonna use the Octobrush, like, bigger. Um. Do I have to, um...
Not that easy. Wait, wait. It's a salmon. Did did we draw? We draw a dolphin. We drew a dolphin. All right. That seems like it. We're hinting towards something. You don't. You don't draw shit like that and just hope. It doesn't. You you don't draw something like that without hinting towards it. A bigger picture. Small fry, where is it? Small fry. All right, um, yeah, let's do the boss now. Let's do the boss. Ah, shit. Okay, from what I know so far, hold on. Let me archive. I'll read. I'm not gonna read the archive live. How much? How much is this next level? Four sardines. Four sardines. All right, well, let's enter this one. This is either going to be Big Man or Shiver. We already did Fry, Big Man or Shiver. I don't know. Because I already know they're... Because we already know they suck ass. Uh, Shiver. You don't show this much blue. Originally, it was yellow. This is a lot more blue. And I'm just wondering if we're building a glider of some sort because I saw the first... Yep, Shiver. All right. <sighs> Too delicate. No, I'm going to win this fight. I see you. Too easy. Guess you're pretty... We'll have to teach you some manners. Join me, Master Mega. Oh! I fucking knew the shark. Okay, it was a shark then. Parallel to the Megal Megalodon. Okay. One thing I always wondered in Splatoon is how c none of the protagonists talk. None of them do. Do you... Do we have to throw... Oh, shit, my armor. Ooh, fuck. Is it weird I want to throw... It's huge. The mouth is huge. Do I want to throw something in there? I don't know. That, that, that kind of seems sus. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I know. That may be... S Poor choice of words. Poor choice of words. That's all I'm going to say. Big splash down. God damn it. Yeah, the boss fights are a lot more confusing. Because the first time I did the boss fight, it was a little confusing, but... I, I'm getting the hang of it now, but still. Fry's boss fight was a little confusing because I just didn't understand. All 
Oh, I'm supposed to... I'm supposed to throw a... I'm supposed to throw a small fry in there. I get it now. I get it. Uh, appetizer. Master. I need to really focus this time. Master Mega. Let's finish this. Okay. I, I didn't know there were any more sharks, by the way. I didn't know sharks were still alive after what happened. Uh, 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 tornado. I don't think we can throw a bomb in there because we use small fry, I think. Oh, we can throw bombs. I didn't think we could. Yeah, fight so far have been pretty easy, not gonna lie. What's with you? Master, you have to get serious or else. What are you going to do? What are you going to do against a big ass shark? That shark will fucking kill you. You were talking a lot of shit for someone inviting the range. Shit. I don't think you're that capable because the fact that you need him to beat me, it would just be better off to just splat me. Yeah, I thought this would be a. I, I, I originally I thought that, oh no, small arena, but no, this is not that bad. Yeah. So I'm just gonna leave him in. Oh, I can splat him from the side. Oh my god. Oh, it makes everything so much more easier. That easy. Too easy. I'm s too easy. You're not, are you, are you going to respawn? All right. Good. I was, that was enough. I think that was enough of a lesson. Yeah. You Have you learned your lesson? Haven't seen the last. Uh, You're going to die pretty soon. I'm, I'm sure of that. I'm sure of that. You're just hurting yourself. You are not, you are not that guy, pal. You are not that guy. Uh, hold on. This consultation, this as a consultation. Is this a gl glider? Because this got me confused. I don't know what this quite is. I don't know. Well, anyway, that's enough for this episode. I'm going to do the rest of the levels off, off camera. But thank you guys for watching. I will see you all next time on the next video. I am back making fucking videos again. I am unstoppable. Goodbye. I am God. All right, guys, um, I just got this again, so we're just going to go ahead and listen to this cutscene. We're going to listen to this cutscene because I thought it was originally over, but yeah, let's just listen to that. Do you read me? Come in. Gramps on the line. Hello, Gramps. Oh, Agent One, good to hear your voice. I'm still locked in some kind of room, finding the exits like looking for a needle in a coral reef fish. Oh, I mean, I better shout, whisper, someone, oh, I better shout, whisper, someone's coming. Ah, you woken from your hibernation half and have you, cuttlefish? 
This is not DJ Octavio. Because, I don't know, what happened to DJ Octavio? Because we knew in the beginning, DJ Oc- we beat his ass, first thing, DJ Octavio. I'm, I don't know who's this. I don't know what, because I don't know what's happened to DJ Octavio. We know Gramps is kidnapped again. Uh, that's former Captain Cuttlefish. Former Captain Cuttlefish. Who are you? Anyway? F- former, yeah, passing it on. You live your life for an old bag of does your species have bones? Don't matter. You can call me Mr. Oh my god, Grizzco. Oh my god, Mr. Grizz. Grizzco. Mr. Grizz is back. Grizz, I know Mr. Grizz. This is the guy who fucking, I don't know. This is the Salmon Run nigga. All right. So Mr. Grizz from Salmon Run. All right, well, now's the real ending of this video. Thank you guys for watching. See you all next time, and goodbye. I still don't fucking know. All right. I still don't know why Mr. Grizz would be here. All right, well, that's enough streaming for to. Well, that's enough videos for today. Thank you guys for watching this. See you all next time, and goodbye. I am God. For the last time, I will not be saying this again, no matter if there's no more cutscenes. Goodbye.